Hello guys, to a brand new episode of uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. So, uh, when we last left off, we were in a pretty bad shape. We just landed in Saint Denis. Uh, I'll just show you guys. So he is sick for some reason. Um, though, so there's the thing which I'm worried about. It says sickness cannot be easily cured. So which means it can be cured, but uh, it's not like you can take some medicine or something so i have did some uh, research on the internet and people are telling like uh, you have to sleep and eat and uh, take a bath so i just uh, went to a hotel room and took a bath a couple of times and i regularly sleep so what my guess is uh, anyway it didn't change anything for me so my guess is you have to do it for some time in a like a routine basis like every night you go to sleep and uh, yeah some things like that i've been uh trying to do that and i'm gonna continue doing that one more thing i'm gonna show you guys is the weight which is now in acceptance level i'd say because uh, last it was horrible man it was like minus eight or nine i was thinking i don't know he was looking really thin and it was like damage absorption is minus nine point something percent it was so i came here and it is like for two days consistently i was eating my entire inventory <laughs> i had three thousand dollar so i just didn't worry about the money i just keep eating and eating and then went to the general store again bought the entire stuff and keeping so after doing it twice uh now it is 0.75 now the change in weight it doesn't happen uh in just like uh, you know in a moment or something you have to wait for it for example uh, i think two nights back i had my last meal at that time it was three percent uh, stamina plus three and damage minus three and that was the last time i had anything and now i am having what 0.75 so so the food takes time uh, to get reflected in your weight uh, apparently there are only two mission available one is uh, with Sadie Adler which I think freeing up uh, John which I want to do first the second one is over here with Dutch which is uh, I think we are moving again from here because everything is packed up I don't know where we're gonna move next maybe somewhere here which is my guess i don't know because this is the only region which we have never been to let's see let's start the sadie adler and freeing up john mission uh what transition oh he's coughing again man It doesn't say he's that sick, right? I don't know, man. I think this is the curing mission. I don't know. Let's see. Uh oh. Oh, man. What the? Nope, I'm not alright. Hey, what are you doing? Stop dragging me. Mister, are you okay? Mister, are you okay? Uh, I don't think so, buddy. Are you okay, mister? <laughs> mister, you, you don't look so good. Nope. Let's get you to a doctor. I just went to a doctor. He didn't have much stuff. Okay, so he's gonna turn. Oh, I have to walk? Just let me check again, guys. Nah, everything is cool. Everything is same as before. Oh, there's blood. I'm fine. 
Hả? No. Hey, you head in there, friend. Go on. Can I help you? Oh, I, I need a doctor. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Come in, pal. Come in. I'm trying to move. Oh, now I can move. I need some help. And so it seems. <coughs> and that's Dr. Mister to you. I'm sorry. Uh, I was joking. Uh, look, friend, I don't mean nothing, but you got money? Yes, I've got. I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, let do uh, Sure. Thank you. Now, what's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them and <laughs> Is there any blood? Sometimes. Yep. Uh -huh. okay, Ammonia? Breathe. Again. Okay. Let me see your tongue. And say ah. Ah. Tuberculosis or kind of thing? What is it? Not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. Oh, what do you mean? You're real sick. You. It's a progressive disease. And you'll be. Now, the best Dead. thing is rest. And getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure. I can just take my winters in my country club. In California, no, it's not possible. Well, like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Yeah, but well, wait, wait. Uh, let me get you a little bit more energy today. Oh boy, so now I have to cure myself kind of thing. What is that? Why there is nobody? Uh, what? Weapon wheels, I can't check. Leave the area? Uh, I can see my horse over that way. I don't know which area, which way. I, I'm gonna walk like this. Um, I'm a bit confused, guys. Change what's done. We can only move on. Okay. I can't choose my satchel, weapon wheel, anything. This is my maximum speed. I can tell. He didn't have a choice. He was good and he did good. Um, how long I have to work? Is it like he's thinking on his mind what he has done throughout his life and all kind of thing because he's thinking like he's dying? Oh, that's Mary Linton. Uh, guys, I can't control my character properly. We don't stop soon. We'll all be dying. I can just give any direction. He's walking straight ahead. Left, right doesn't work. Well, she was a fool then. Uh, stop! Why don't you move from these tram tracks? 
the deer. Follow the deer. Of course, I'm going to do that. You will only gain the benefit from consuming. Don't be afraid. Don't be shy. Well, limited amount of food and drink. What? Okay, um... There was a side quest uh, with the mayor is gone now. There is one more side quest. I'm gonna do all the side quests guys, but first I'm gonna do this one. I'll just resume the video as soon as I reach there guys. Hello guys, uh, I am just uh, deviating a bit from my plan. So I was thinking like I'll take this mayor side quest and then I'll continue this mission because this is going to be a small video anyway so yeah why not do this side quest first because it seems that a few of the side quests also take importance in the you know curing him is it mayor or something else I'm not sure though anyway one moment please this is extremely delicate. Hey. There. Oh, wonderful. Algernon Wasp, purveyor of the exotic and the exquisite. Enchanté. Uh, Tassus <laughs> Kilgore. How can I help you? May I interest you in a uh, hat, perhaps? What? No. Why would I want that? How about a nymph? I import them from Brussels. The idiots in this town all want Italian nymphs, but the Italians make the coarsest of marble. I mean, quite frankly, the Baroque is an abomination. Belgium. Now that is a land for the connoisseur. Oh, yes. Yeah, as I always say. But, you know, I'm not really a nymph kind of man. No, oh, of course, too ephemeral. You want something, uh, more tangible, more gothic. I also make corsets. <laughs> Would you like a corset? I always wear one. Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> Why would you want a corset? Um, the whalebone might stick in. Mm, well, a cup of tea. Uh, sure. And what is it you do, Mr. Kilgore? Are you a gentleman of leisure? An aesthete? <gasps> an artist. <laughs> well, I suppose I'm kind of an adventure. Oh, okay. Yes, of course you are. You know, be careful with the china, sir. It is French. Not Belgian? No, no, no. They are Philistines in that area, not to be trusted. You uh -huh. eternally preserved in marble is more their specialty. I fear China will always elude them. Now, why are you here exactly? <laughs> I don't know. You're an adventurer, a wanderer, a lost soul cast out from heaven. <sighs> sure. Well, <laughs> I do pay exceptionally well for certain objects needed for my art. Mm, you do? I do. Exceptionally well. Well, what do you need? Let's see. Right now, I have a couple of commissions. I need at least 15 egret plumes. Good ones, obviously. Okay. I also need 15 assorted orchids. Here's a list. Okay. I will see what I can do. Thanks for the tea. Okay. Thank you, Tacitus. That's It'll it. It'll be very worth your while. Uh, let me check what this guy need. Five elite egret. Okay, so these are like uh, herb collection. I'll just. I might do it later, man. This is not so related to her quest, I think. Okay. Uh, I, I was just curious, so I just took this quest. Uh, seems like a mayor's house. But this one was the mayor's house, if I'm not wrong. Anyway, um, I'll resume the video once we reach here, guys. I'll see you there soon my way to the story quest I have figured out one more stranger quest and this seems to be the sister whom I have helped many times not many times once already brother Dorkins and I were talking about you just the other day and hoping we would see you again how is brother Dorkins? oh he's quite well a little frustrated with the workings of our order 
He keeps trying to be sent overseas, you know, do something with more challenge, maybe uh, be a missionary. He's a lovely man. Sure. And how are you? Uh, Not good. Better. Seriously, are you dude? Sure? Uh, I'm quite sure, sister. You know, a long time ago, I was like you. I very much doubt that. <laughs> oh, 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 I did terrible things, awful things. And I could not stop doing terrible things because I did not believe that goodness existed. And then one day I saw that love did exist. And ever since then, doing bad things became, well, not impossible, but ridiculous. <laughs> I guess I'm just hoping for a, a dignified exit. I shall pray for you. Oh, I'm not a religious man, sister. <laughs> I'm an outlaw. <laughs> Man, <laughs> he looks sick. Hearts are rarely pure, but equally they are rarely impure either. Well, that's an interesting way of putting it. To me, God is people and people are God. So, we must all do what we can. These people are starving. Go find them some food. Don't worry so much about your heart. The actions will lead, and the heart follows. I'll still think of you in very nasty terms, <laughs> as you wish. Ah, uh, what is that? Donate food. Okay. Um. You know what, I'll donate all this because I can buy all of this. Oh man, it's gonna take time, isn't it? What? What? See, guys, see, it's three. It became two. Now it still remains two. <laughs> I have to change it or what? You know what, sister? I think I've already got plenty of food on me. They could just eat my... You are wonderful, Mr. Morgan. Now, that ain't true. Oh, I meant wonderful, but... so very frightening. As you wish. I can donate more here? Oh, good no. deed done for the day. Thank you. I won't subject you to any so this increases our this stats. We are almost complete white. I could have given ten dollars though, but still anyway. No. Nope. Let's talk to Sadie. And uh, one thing I am gonna show you guys is after I got uh, tuberculosis, my health core is in worst condition is available 20 percent one-fifth this is really really bad now few people i asked around they're like uh, they didn't want to spoil why how it is cured or whatever so i didn't dig around <laughs> let's see seriously any problems coming in nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. Well, at least you're alive. For now, yeah. Yeah, exactly, for now. What happened in... Um... Guam? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing nice. What happened to Dutch? Because he seems... I don't know. Seems as... What began happening in Blackwater began happening... Years ago, maybe. Slow decline, I guess. What do you mean? I ain't quite sure. What happened here? I started gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And John, you know that part. I do. And Hosea? So that too. Hell, we got Lenny's body out as well. Bribed the morgue and buried them together. Thank you. He was a good friend. Me. I'm gonna miss this guy, man. Lenny is like one of those characters whom 
I'm gonna love. I love this this guy, man. We made lot of nice missions together. I'm gonna have to eat something. My cores are getting down. I'll take this first. So, what's your plan here? Uh, I'll have well, some other biscuits. We, do anything, we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. And okay. How do we, do that? we need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. What? You're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found us a hot air balloon. What? You ain't serious. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. A bit of a tour. <laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know, nice. Hot air balloon. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. Whole thing hit folks real hard. You can see it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss is a bag of nerves. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. So I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. That was a good idea. <laughs> Until the Pinkerton showed up. Oh, by the way, I've been hunting O'Driscoll boys. Nice. Two of the sons of bitches at a campsite last week. Of what? me. Yeah. Seems they've drifted down this way now. Hey, there's the one. She a beauty, ain't she? From yes. On the ground. Yes. <laughs> Mr. Bullard. Hmm. Mr. Buller. Ah, Mrs. Adler. It's good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, uh, this is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullard. At your service, sir. At your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, and Icarus would have made it across the sea. Ha ha ha. Have you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. Well, ain't she coming? Ah, uh, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? They can. Oh no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. Vapors. Well, knew about that. Why a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above or below. <laughs> She's disgusted. I told you you two would get on. Uh, are you sure about this? Certain, sir. Quite certain. Mrs. Let us away. Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, pull on that rope <laughs> and hope for the best. Ah! You boys have fun. How did you get out of this? <laughs> okay. Okay. Hold, okay. Right. Time Can't to move. Vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. Okay, we can't move yet, guys. Seriously? Everything is foggy. Okay, it is the... Ugh. Decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. Keep going, sir! We need to get up above the clouds. What? It really is stunning up there. You'll have seen nothing like it. Above the cloud? Man, seriously? I can't see anything. Uh, you can see the R2 bar which is uh, filling and it's not even halfway there. Alright then, let's break through these clouds. Oh. Man, look at those cloud dynamics. I can see the cloud going down. Yes, heavenly indeed. 
Quite remarkable, isn't it? Feels like we have a nice westerly wind, so keep her around this height. Okay. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Imported wow. from Europe. Won't find more than a couple of these on this side of the pond. So long as it works. You sure you shouldn't be doing this? <laughs> no, not at all. A child could operate this. Uh, I'm side. getting Mrs. down. Very keen to learn the ropes. We have plenty of those. She's okay. Good, so we have to be on the yellow mark, which is right here. Let me see, guys. Oh, so that's the jail. Oh, nice, nice. Now I got it. Because it was showing like. Uh, How perfect is this? It was showing I like it's restricted. Of the My brother's called Valdesario, so you could say I got off light. Look, I I'm trying to concentrate here. <laughs> wow, man, this cloud dynamics is so beautiful. <sighs> that's better. Look, we can see from miles now. Did you breakfast in the city this morning, Mr. Morgan? Not exactly. Well, I have a boiled egg in my pocket. Oh, look at the train. I think I'm all right, thank you. Recalling the ablutions uh, discussion. Well, just say the word. Uh, we can't control the way it's moving, I guess. The sun's reflection. So if I may ask, what got you interested in the pursuit of aviation? Uh, I didn't exactly. Uh, Mrs. Adler. <laughs> ah, a very nice woman. And no shrieking violet. Where are we now? We are just crossing this. Islands, nice. Definitely not. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very spice of life, as they say. <laughs> or is it though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in a mental asylum? <laughs> I did not, Mr. <laughs> That's some unwanted stats, buddy. See that building wow. on the island? That's the infamous Sisica Penitentiary. Oh, is it? I think he meant that one. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. What do you mean? Mr. Morgan, please, this is most irregular. Well, you want a happy customer, don't you? Look, this isn't funny, Handel. What are we are in the zone. Our driver, uh, not driver, our pilot is scared. Stay high enough. I, I'm just looking for a friend of mine. A friend? The <laughs> bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. Okay, I am supposed to be down, not up. Okay, it's cinematics. The I wind. can't. Well, this is most unusual. Relax, Mr. Bullard. Here, take over. You keep us well away. I'll do my best. This filly isn't the easiest to control, you know. This was not the tour I had in mind. Um, where am I gonna look? That's not him. By the barn. Okay, so barn is that ain't John. All right, let's try one of the other fields. Okay. Please hurry. 
none of them are maybe Which one? I have no idea. Uh oh! My God! What are you doing? They're shooting at us! I can see that. Ascent! Ascent! Come on! Get up! Just don't shoot the balloon. The wind speed is picking up. We should stay at this altitude. It's heading northwesterly, so that should take us back to land. <laughs> nice. That was a funny mission. Uh, we're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. Get up. Good lord. My heart is pounded. <sighs> I must say that the specifics of this job are not described to me at all sufficiently. Well, it's done now. <laughs> Mrs. Adler? Where? Being chased. Chased? Uh, O'Driscoll's? Oh, yeah. I expect so. I'm starting to rather enjoy this. Nope. I will say it! Up there! Ooh, beautiful. Mrs. Amber has a lot to answer for. Yes, she does. What's the excitement I've had in gears? Oh, done? Oh, there are more coming. Oh. Oh, there are three. Oh, seriously? Oh, this is beautiful, man. Oh, she's in trouble. Seriously? Nice. I don't think there's anybody else. What the? Oh, shoot. Damn it, man. Get up, get up, get up. You're too high. Okay, sorry, my bad. Lower, Arthur. Alright, hold it there, Arthur. Now it. Up, up. Let's get out of here. Okay. Okay, I have to tap. I was just holding. I can't hold on much longer. I got you, Miss Adler. I think we're gonna crash. We have a real habit of seeing the obvious, Arthur. Hold on. <laughs> In the water. <laughs> nice. Did you break your neck? I don't think so. Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Oh, damn it! Look, there's more of them on the 
other side. They must have followed us. Get behind something. This ain't over yet. I'm gonna These give them hell. You can't leave it for one day. Just kill me, sons of bitches! Not a problem. Behind us. You ain't goddamn man. Shit. There's even more than coming out of the woods. Oh. Seriously? You boys are a goddamn joke. Come out. Just once. Oh. How many of them are there? Man, I'm in a really bad spot. Where are the rest? Ooh. Come on! Let's move up and finish these bastards! Why are you moving up? You can't Come on, man. Give me something. Look at those cowards. Yeah, you run. I'll catch up with you soon enough. Looks like we made it. That'll show them. She's some aggressive, crazy lady. Um, I shall come here and then maybe some dialogues will be there. Yep. I only left you an hour ago. You can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour. You got that poor bastard killed for his troubles. I kind of liked him. They got Comb, the government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. They're gonna hang him in San Denis. Hang him? Okay. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't, because we're going to make sure of it. I... We have our own problems with the law, in case you ain't noticed. Dutch will want to see him swing. Sure, Dutch. He wouldn't even help us with Marston. And our situation is really messed up right now. You know how things is. Bastard's yep. going to swing. I'm going to make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. You saw him? Yes, in the fields. Okay. Then we go rescue him. <coughs> Seriously? Stay paying attention? No. But from the fields? Yes. That we can manage. It's well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. Hmm. She has a point. Not behind bars. So, that's how we'll do it. Bust him from his work detail. Yes. It's best just the two of us go. <coughs> the two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good, because two is all we'll need. I'll get us a boat, a little one, and we'll sneak in and get him out of there. <laughs> Meet me at Copperhead Landing. Thank you, Arthur. Whatever you say, boss. I heard that. Ah. <sighs> what? What is that? Pick it, I'll eat. I need a lot of food. Okay, uh, this was a nice mission guys. So I'm gonna wrap this video up here. And 
I'll be back with the next part soon and let's see which part will be next this is Dutch's mission and I don't want to do Dutch's mission now oh there is the mad scientist again there is one more mission of uh, edit downs there was a mission here he is not available anymore nothing okay guys uh this is it for this part in the next part when we come back we will probably do either uh this one annisberg and or this one in either of those i'll try to finish um yeah well i hope you guys are liking these videos please do like share subscribe whatever you want to do with these parts i'll be back with the next part soon until then take care and bye bye